you're at a holiday party and you notice two types of people. There's a person that's first in line getting the eggnog and then there's a person that just blows right by it. Well, no matter who you are, you probably don't know what's really in it. My name is Mary, I'm with ABC Fine Wine and Spirits and I'm here to tell you what is in your eggnog. Eggnog is a creamy spiced beverage and love it or hate it, it's tradition. So how does a drink that consists of raw eggs and milk get to be so popular around the holidays? Well, it's steeped in history and soaked in spirits. So the exact history of eggnog is a little bit fuzzy. It seems to have started as a non-alcoholic beverage in England and like the true American way, the American colonists started adding alcohol. It started as rum, but depending on taxation and access, they substituted any spirit that was available from bourbon to brandy. Skip forward over a century later and a non-alcoholic version of our festive favorite is now lining our grocery stores. So the most commonly asked question when talking about eggnog is, is it actually made with raw eggs? Well, the short answer is yes, but if you're buying the non-alcoholic version at a grocery store, it's pasteurized, which means that it's slightly cooked and it will get rid of any aspect of salmonella. The problem with that is, it doesn't contain any alcohol. So I'm gonna show you a super simple eggnog recipe that you can make at home with either rum, brandy, or bourbon. So for this recipe, you'll need six eggs, one cup of sugar, a half teaspoon of salt, one cup of your favorite spirit, whether that's bourbon, brandy, or rum, one pint of heavy cream, one pint of whole milk, and some freshly ground nutmeg. First, you're gonna to wanna to separate your eggs into egg whites and egg yolks. In a medium bowl, beat your egg yolk and a quarter cup of sugar until the yolks are lighter in color and the sugar is fully dissolved. Next, you're gonna to wanna to add the milk, cream, whatever spirit you chose, and the salt, and whisk it all together. In a separate bowl, beat the egg whites and the remaining sugar until you have stiff peaks. If you wanna know when it's ready, put the bowl over your head and see if it comes out. Gently fold the egg whites into the bowl with your creamy mixture. You take that thing that's in your head, uh -huh. and you... If you say fold in one more time... It says fold it in! Now that your mixture is already stirred together, you're gonna wanna chill it for at least three hours before serving. After you pour it into individual glasses, add some freshly ground nutmeg before you serve it. This recipe serves about 10 to 12 people. So what do you do if you don't feel like doing all that work? Well, before I answer that question, make sure to like, subscribe, and ring that notification bell. Want to have the half, half, happiest Christmas ever without doing all of that work? Well, we've already established that you can't buy alcoholic eggnog at a grocery store, but the good news is, is you can at ABC. My personal favorite is Zachariah Harris, but you can check out all of the other brands that we have available to you at abcfws.com. And check out our other videos.